Whoa, hey, what's up? It's been like a whole year since we made a video about DBD, an unintentional series I made because for whatever reason my game just didn't want to work for me. But hey, what's going on? My name is Matt and you know damn well what this video is about because you're here and you want to know why your game's not going to work. Well, for whatever reason, back way when, when I started this video series, my DBD just didn't want to work. Like if I had the game installed and I launched it, I launched the game, and for whatever reason, it just got to the loading screen uh, where it was the, I think it was right after the cutscene where the little streaks come in, and uh, basically it just stops right there, and then it just kills the game. Like, it freezes and it kills the game. But now, I think I found a solution. There was a workaround in my second video. Uh, shout out to Nando. His, his comment's gone for some reason, but it's immortalized in the video, so it's okay. But he was the one that initiated this whole workaround idea. And uh, he basically just said to cut the Windows audio and then basically launch the game after that. And then it would work. You just got to turn Windows audio back on again. But here's the thing. I got to thinking, you know, with my whole life changing around me, I thought, you know, why is DVD not working? Why is it giving me issues? And maybe, oh, I don't know, the 5,000 other people that are having issues too. Uh, well, here's the thing. If you are a PC player, probably consider resetting your windows now we did kind of touch on this a little bit because i thought that updating windows was the only way to progress and maybe get those files on uncorrupted on your system but i think that's what happened i think i had corrupted files somehow i kind of maybe messed around with audio settings too much so that's probably why it just wouldn't let me launch the game so i reset my windows on windows 10 which is not as scary as you think because when I did that, I basically just had the option to reset Windows in my settings and get a local backup or a cloud backup. I did a little bit of research, and I believe that the cloud backup is a better way to go. Because then if you have anything local that's still messed up, it won't go back in your system. Basically, it'd be just, like, fresh. We just want the freshest Windows we can get. Like, you picked it right from the bunch. But still, uh, we did that, and uh, we reset the Windows, and it works. It, it, it works, like, straight up. Like, I downloaded DBD right after that. It was my first little thing. I was like, huh, I reset Windows. I wonder if DBD is going to finally work. And it did. I'm happy to say that it runs perfectly fine. I also got a 3070 Ti Master that I put in my system. That may have helped in some way, but I can run the game on ultra settings. I can just launch the game in general. So that's pretty good. And that's the only thing I ever wanted. That's it. I would recommend resetting your windows. It's not going to be an issue. However, I'm going to give this disclaimer once more. If you have any other programs or any other data or files on the same storage device as your Windows OS, it's going to get reset. So what I recommend doing, it because it, what it does is basically removes all the programs and then you have to reinstall it. But it's a good thing because it also gives you a list of what was uninstalled and you can reinstall it pretty easily. But... If you don't want them uninstalled, just take them and move them on a separate storage device. So if you have a, like another, you know, SSD or hard drive, just just move it on there before you do the reset, so you don't have to re-download it. But that's up to you, though. I mean, I upgraded to another SSD, so I'm just re-downloading everything I got. It doesn't matter to me, but that's up to you. I was just gonna say because it might be a little bit inconvenient for most people, but eh, it's whatever. But it works. We're done. We beat it. Um. Is the game going to change at all? Yeah. You know, it's still crappier than ever, but at least we can play together. And we don't have to have any more issues launching the game. My name is Matt, aka Carbo97. Peace the hell out, guys. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.